Hello friends, as CBS's Jim Nance would say, the 2021 Masters Golf Tournament is upon us. For the first time since 2017, the Masters will not have Tiger Woods, five-time winner of the Green Jacket, as he is recovering from a horrific motor vehicle accident in February. The defending champion for this event is Dustin Johnson, who set a record for lowest 72-hole score in Masters tournament history in the first ever Masters held in the month of November. This year's event is back in its traditional spot on the calendar, the month of April, where golf season typically begins all around the country. The Masters is best described as a tradition unlike any other. It's a tradition because it is held every year at a course in northern Georgia called Augusta National. It's a tradition because the winner of the Masters is given a green jacket, just not like mine. It's a tradition because the Masters represents the beginning of spring and the hope and optimism that comes with it. There is also a tradition that something new happens every year at Augusta. Last year, for example, it was held without patrons. That's how fans are described down there. And it took place in November. This year is no exception, as it will include something new. There will be a new honorary starter to help kick off this year's Masters. Scheduled to join past Masters champions, Jack Nicklaus and Gary Player, is Lee Elder the first African-American golfer to participate in a Masters tournament. Not since Tiger Woods in 2002 has there been a repeat Masters champion, but Dustin Johnson, who is currently the number one ranked golfer in the world, stands primed to repeat as Masters champion. However, he has major competition to contend with. Past major champions, such as Justin Thomas, Colin Morikawa, Bryson DeChambeau, Brooks Kepka, and even Jordan Spieth have more than enough talent to take on DJ. Other golfers gunning for their first green jacket include Spain's John Rahm, Rory McIlroy of Northern Ireland, Turrell Hatton of England, and Tony Finau and Xander Shuffley of the USA. The competition is so deep that anyone can have a realistic chance at this edition of the Masters. <laughs>